I am in a small mountain town called Nagakot, which is about one and a half hours away from Kathmandu. The elevation here is a little bit over 2000 meters. And yeah, this is the little village here. And my first mission today is to uh, find a haircut. I am in desperate need of a haircut. I am not sure though if it will be possible to uh, find a place here where I can get a haircut. There's no place on Google Maps, but that usually doesn't mean anything in small rural places like this. Actually, there's one right here. Namaste. Namaste. Can I get a haircut here? Uh, sure. Yes? Yeah. Okay. I need a rating time? Yeah, yeah. No problem. Time, yeah. How many minutes? Like 30 minutes. 30 minutes? Okay, I have a walk around and then I come back? Yeah, sure. Okay, thank you very much. Oh, actually, that was way easier than I thought. There they have that place right here. But uh, yeah, rating time 30 minutes, so let's use the time to uh, have a walk around this beautiful village here. Yeah, basically all these buildings here on the left are hotels and then all of these hotels have a beautiful view to the valley on the other side. Okay, I think this is like the, the main square of the village. We have some restaurants here, some hotels. And actually I would like to have some, some supplies. No, no, namaste. I'm looking for some snacks. Yeah. yeah. Cookies? Cookies, yeah, something like cookies. Do you have cookies? Mm. Because after the haircut, I'm actually planning to go hiking. So I think some supplies. Oh, what do you have here? Spicy biscuits. Oh, spicy, it's uh, I think not the right thing for me to eat when I want to go hiking. Oh, this sounds actually good. How much is this? How much? 60? Yeah. Okay, then I would like to get these ones. Yeah, some cookies for the for the hiking. Because mm. I'm actually not sure how many hours the hike will uh, will be. I'm guessing a few uh, hours actually. All right, some supplies for the for the hike later on. Actually, what is it? Uh, high fiber. Mm. Some cookies. But <laughs> I'm just realizing she charged me 60 rupees, right? Actually, the you see it. Right on the package here, it says 50 rupees. But I guess that is a, a little uh, markup price because we are somewhere in the mountains here. So it's probably expensive to, to get the cookies up here. <laughs> so that's okay, no problem. Oh wow, check it out. Yeah, whenever there's a, a view because there's no building, you have a glimpse on the, on the valley here basically, which is uh, really astonishing of course. Maybe if you are lucky later, um, the hike that I'm planning to do, in theory you can see the Himalayas from, from that hike and also the Mount Everest in theory. But it is a little bit foggy today, so I'm not sure if we will be uh, lucky enough to see that. But uh, fingers crossed. Can I buy bananas here? Yeah? Okay, I think I just get maybe one or two. And then, can I get just one or two? Oh, yeah. Just uh, oh, that was a small one. Okay, two bananas. Okay. And then I pay inside. Okay. Okay, just the two bananas here. Okay, sir. How much? Only those two. Only those two, yeah. Okay. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. You want this ripe banana? Uh, no, that's a little bit too dark. <laughs> the inside good. I know, I know, but uh, I prefer these ones actually. Okay, no problem. Uh, this is cheaper one. That's why. Right. It's cheaper. Yeah. That's okay. That's twenty. In 30 rupees. How much is this? 10? I think it's 40 then, right? Okay. All right, I think now we are prepared for the hike. Uh, I have water already in my bag, so that's not needed. Actually, I'm just seeing um, there's a little hill up here. Maybe that's like a viewpoint. So let's uh, have a look at that. Or maybe this is the, the local bus stop here. Some chickens running around. Reminds me a little bit um, about some areas that I have seen in central Sri Lanka. Maybe you remember some of my videos from like a year ago. It looked uh, actually similar there. Namaste. Oh. Wow. This is a very beautiful spot. Oh. This is amazing. Actually, there are quite a few uh, houses everywhere. So um, so this is uh, like the main village, the Nagakot village. But it looks like all around the mountains here there are some small little corners spread around where 
there are a few more houses although I guess that most of these buildings that you see are actually hotels because there are actually quite a few hotels in this uh, area here um, for obvious reasons of course wow this is very nice also I'm a little bit curious now to see if I will be able to get a local price for the haircut in the past days I uh, asked some locals like my taxi drivers or the staff at my hotel hey how much do you pay for a, for a haircut here and everyone said 150 rupee maximum 200 so let's see what I have to pay here all right let's get my first haircut in Nepal namaste namaste I can get a haircut now yeah okay oh so much hair on the floor <laughs> Oh. Are you the only uh, haircut place in Nagakot? Yes, sir. Yeah, right. Yeah, I haven't seen another place so far. Mm -hmm. So all the, the haircut business is for you. <laughs> Everyone needs to come to you. Okay, so maybe I can put my, my hoodie here. So. <laughs> okay. So actually, I need to uh, show him what I'd like to have. I always have a picture, example picture on my phone. You can do like this. Okay. Yeah. Okay, sure. Also the, the line. Okay. line? okay. Yeah. This is the example picture I always use. A picture I took many years ago in a barber shop in Thailand. That's always the example. Okay. Right. You okay? I filmed the haircut. Okay? okay? Okay, good. What is your name? Baharab Lal. Baharab Lal? Baharab. Baharab? Yes. Okay. I am Ken. Nice to meet you. <laughs> okay. Is it okay from the height or should I go more down? Uh, no it's okay? <laughs> because I'm very tall. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sometimes uh, the, barber, the barbers I go to, they have to use a little uh, chair here to, uh, to elevate themselves. You only do haircut for men or also for a lady? Lady? You also do haircut for women? For only, only men? Yeah. Only men? Okay, okay. okay. Okay, the first part is done. Cutting the sides with the, with the razor. Yeah, that's uh, very good so far. And uh, yeah, now he's uh, taking the scissors to uh, to go uh, into some details and also to get rid of the, the hair on the top. Okay, looks already much better than before. <laughs> Completely wet. Ah. Do you also do shaving? Shaving? Yeah, okay. can. Yeah. Okay, then let's also get a shave, which uh, usually makes me look uh, way younger. <laughs> yeah, when I'm completely shaved, you will see the difference. I look like uh, like very young again. Although I look uh, young already, most people guess my age way younger than I actually am. He's now uh, working on the on the line that I usually have on the side. Good chat, haircut, good chat. Looks good, yes. Thank you. Yes. I am happy. <laughs> <laughs> line. It's very good, yes, yes, very good. Shave it, sir? Yes, him, please. Him, sir? Yeah, yeah. Mm, smells good. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Like a, like a, almost like toothpaste, the smell. Oh, 
Alright. Now I look uh, like 10 years younger. Very good. Very good. फोटो खींचने हो ये है भी आओ ओके समझ गए यस लुक्स वेरी गुड आह फ्रेश एंड नाइस हेयर कट अगेन क्लीन शेव लुकिंग टेन इयर्स यंगर आह वेरी गुड वेरी गुड ओके राइट हाउ मच डू यू गेट Okay, have a good day. Bye bye, bye bye. All right, clean and fresh haircut again. Namaste. Namaste. All right, and yeah, as you saw, um, he charged me now 500, which is uh, more than three times the price that the locals told me that usually a haircut cost here. Okay, I also had a shave, so maybe let's add. A little bit extra for the shave but still i think uh, he charged a little bit too much let me know in the comment section if you're from nepal if uh, this is an okay price or not um anyway i am happy with the haircut but um oh, just the view here is uh, amazing again right ah, ah i think all of you uh, know this feeling when you're just coming from a from a barber you have a fresh haircut again got a little massage a clean shave feels very good right Anyway, okay, let's leave the little village here and find the start of the hiking trail which uh, should be like 10 minutes down the road here. And actually there is something that causes a problem for me here in Nepal. I can't access my favorite music app which is YouTube Music. It's blocked here and that actually is the case in many countries that I travel to that some websites or apps that I use are blocked, they are geo-restricted. But luckily I'm also having a solution for that, something that every traveler should have, Surfshark VPN. With the help of a VPN service you can virtually change the location of your phone or your laptop to basically anywhere in the world and therefore unblock geo-restricted content. So I am just virtually changing my location, let's say, back to Germany and then I am able to access YouTube music again. And yeah, having a VPN service is also very important for your internet security. When you are connected to a VPN it encrypts the data that is sent between your phone or your laptop and the internet and therefore your personal information and your private data become safer. So if you are not using a VPN service yet, I highly recommend to start using one. Personally, I am using Surfshark VPN for well over one and a half years already. I can highly recommend them. It is the only VPN to offer one account for unlimited devices. And if you would like to check them out as well, just click the link down below. And if you enter the promo code CAN, you can get three extra months for free. And they also have a 30 day money back guarantee. So you can test it out without any risk. Just click the link down below. Thanks to Surfshark for sponsoring today's video. And now let's go hiking. Actually, I am a little bit hungry. And uh, this man just approached Welcome me. Welcome to what is Greenland. Oh. Oh, namaste. And uh, actually, they have a really nice view here. So maybe I can uh, have a little snack or a drink. Namaste. Hello. Oh, wow. Beautiful view here. Oh, this is incredible. Oh. I am from Germany. Germany. Germany, yes. Wow, very nice country. Yeah? You are from Nepal? Yes. Oh, okay. Nepali. Nepali. Namaste. Namaste. <laughs> How do you like our hotel? The view is incredible view here. Is yeah. Now it will be. Yeah, it's not so clear, weather. right? Weather. Why is it not? Is it fog or smoke? Yeah, sometimes it's smoke. This one like that. Yeah. That's why not clear. Yeah, not if clear. clear we can see the view from here. Yeah, you can even see Mount Everest from here, right? Mount, Mount Everest, we cannot see this area because of half circle, do you know? This ah, side, it's this side, yeah. behind the, yeah, the behind mountain. Side, ah, yeah, okay, okay. Mountain yeah. Everest. Do you think it's like this the whole week? Sorry? Is it like this every day now? No, sometimes like sometime that. Sometimes it's clear? In Nagarkot, 
Here is uh, every day three to four time is the weather is changed. Oh, change a lot. Yeah. Okay, okay. Sometimes raining. Sometimes it's raining. Sometimes oh. it's like this. Is more okay. Like this. That's why. Yeah, I arrived uh, yesterday. Yeah. And it was like this, and then I wake up this morning. It was like this again. Okay. All right. Let's uh, see if we can get a drink or a little snack here before we actually uh, start uh, venturing out into the mountains. And yeah, I can't say no to a little stop with with this view here, right? Wow. Alu pakoda. What, what is pakoda? Pakoda, pakoda. Alu pakoda means potato. Do you know what kind you know of potato? potato? Yeah. That's like a like potato snack. Yeah. Mm, that's something small, right? Not yeah, too big. Small, yeah. Okay. Put the vegetable like that. Which one? Which one is the best? Best vegetable pakoda. Uh, this one is. Alu is with potato. Yeah, alu potato. Yeah. Okay, I, I tried that one. All right. Thank you Thank you very much. It's like this milk tea and then they put some masala spices inside. Usually very delicious and usually sweet already so I don't think I need the extra sugar here. Cheers guys. How do you like the quality? The tea is very delicious. Very good. It's a, you add, um, it's milk tea and then masala spice inside, yeah, we right? Put the milk Mm -hmm. and we make it then we put the masala, Nepali mm -hmm. masala. Yeah, that's what makes the tea very special, I think, yeah. the, the masala spices. Yeah. Very good. Oh, finish already. The is ready. Okay. So what exactly is this? <coughs> this one? Yeah, how, this how, one do you, how do you make this? Like vegetable, we mix the mm -hmm. vegetable and then flour. Flour? Yeah, corn flour. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then what is that? And then chili, you, little bit chili. You fry it? Uh, yeah, we oh, fry it. Okay, okay. Oh, I never tried this before. Is this a Nepali food? Yeah, Nepali. Yes, yeah. okay. All right. Always uh, excited to try something new. Okay, let's try Nepali pukada. You eat it with the hands? Yeah. Yeah, yeah right? Yeah. But only with the right hand. No Not the left hand? Yeah. Right hand also better. The better is the right hand, yeah? The right hand, usually, yeah. right? Yeah, you don't use the left hand here. Mm. Okay. Actually, let me turn the camera to this side so you can see the view but then I have to use the left hand maybe let me fix the problem by placing you guys on the tripod so how does it look so now you can uh, see the view not only my face while well, I can use the, the right hand so we have these little bolts here looks interesting orange uh, color to it and then we have some dipping sauce which I think it's just uh, tomato sauce it's not really hot, it's warm, I'd say, but that makes it very easy and convenient to eat. And then I'm not really sure what, what is inside here. Mm, some vegetables, I think potatoes as well. Some onions, I see some onions as well. Mm, this is exactly what I wanted. A little snack to eat, easy to, to get down, easy to eat. And yeah, I think no matter what you're eating with a view like this, it uh, becomes a, a highlight, right? <laughs> the view is just so incredible here. In case you want to see it more up close. Flour, vegetables, potatoes, onions. And they somehow mix it together. Fry it, as he said. And then you have little really delicious snacks. Really nice. All right. Let's hope that this is not the best view that we will see today. Let's hope for even better views on the hike. But yeah, let me pay now. Okay, how much? How much do you get? I can find this food uh, everywhere in Nepal. Yeah. Well, because sure. I want to eat it again because it was very good. Very good. Where do we stay? Which hotel? Uh, Himalaya. Himalaya villa. Himalaya villa. How yeah. long did we stay here? Oh, I came yesterday. Okay. And I'm not sure how many days I stay here. Maybe. Maybe one. Maybe two. Maybe two three. Days, yeah. I'm not sure. <laughs> two forty. Two hundred forty. 300, that's okay. Extra for a nice view here. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Yeah, sure. Should I, should I write down okay. the, the YouTube? Yeah, yeah. Because uh, he I'm your was followers. asking. Okay. Uh, you can write here. Yeah. Better. Yeah, Better is clean. I will. Better is here. Okay. Just here? Okay. Yeah. Okay, the name is Ken. Can I brought? Can I brought? Can I brought? Okay. Can oh, you can. You have it right here, Vol. C one two. 
Ah, okay, 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 put it right here. <laughs> can can I, I brought? Follow, follow mm. all these two. Mm. Now I have two more. In, no, no, I know in here. Yeah, when two. you came here, yeah. and two. Oh, now I grow by two followers. <laughs> okay. okay. Okay, thank you very much. Nice, nice to, meet to meet you. you. What is the Hi, name of this place? This place is Nagelcourt. I mean, uh, your hotel. This hotel name is Hotel Greenland. Greenland? Greenland, yeah. Hotel and restaurant. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I hear my voice. Oh, she's watching my video already. <laughs> Which video are you watching? Ah, this was in Hong Kong a few weeks ago, yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> are you want to watch as well? Ah, this was in Hong Kong. Hong Kong, what is it? A few weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Nice. Okay. We will be seeing. Okay, enjoy. You are YouTube. Okay. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Ah. Right away, I uh, clicked on my uh, Hong Kong videos from a few weeks ago. Um, okay, Hotel Greenland. If you want to have a nice little snack uh, with a nice view. This is a place to come in Nagakot. Oh, actually, I wanted to ask him about the hike. Because I'm actually not sure where the starting point is. Let me see. I wanted to ask you something. Yes, please. I want to go hiking. Hiking. And I saw on Google Maps there's a hiking trail. But I don't know. You don't know? Yeah, this is ah, Okay. Nagakot Panoramic Hiking Trail. Ah, this one is straight. You can go this straight here. Just straight. Then there is the Nirvana. Yeah. Nirvana and go backside. Okay. Do you, yeah. do you know this trail? Yeah. Do you know yeah. How, how long it is? How many maybe, hours? Maybe uh, one hour. You one hour, two hour like that. One, two hour? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, perfect. You can go straight from here. Yeah. Then. Go this side, near the Nirvana, yeah. Nirvana, then you get round, okay. rounding from this side. Yeah, no, okay. okay, thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Okay, bye bye. All right, he said one to two hours. Um, yeah, I was reading mixed reviews. Some reviews said the same, one to two hours. Some reviews said something about two to three hours. So I'm not sure, but I guess we will find out. No, no, namaste. I hear you singing. Somebody singing? Oh, namaste. Hello. Sounds, sounds good. <laughs> ah, he was the singing? Ah. <laughs> sounds good. Ah, I was walking by here and I, uh, I heard the guys uh, singing. Namaste. Hello. Ah, that was actually quite nice, but I think it was a little bit too late with turning the camera on to... Uh, capture him uh, singing and um, oh, actually this is the, the way down to my hotel if you saw the previous video and um, where I arrived in my hotel here that is down here but I think the hiking trail should be starting up here so actually behind my hotel check it out there's a hotel here called hotel at the end of the universe that is a very interesting name, right? That shows how far in the middle of nowhere we are actually here. Hotel at the end of the universe. I like that name. Okay, so this is actually the area that I can see from uh, my hotel room, which should be one of the buildings over there. And actually that is where I wanted to go. Now I'm not sure how to get there. Down there, you see there are some, some roads, some trails, and that looked very interesting. But now I'm not sure if this is part of the hiking trail I can see on Google Maps, or if that is another area here. Namaste. I'm looking for the hiking trail. Down here? Yes. Yes? And that's the Nagakut Panoramic Hiking Panoramic Trail? trail yes. Yeah? It is. Down here? Yes. Okay. How long does it need to, to walk? Like three to four hours. Three to four depends. hours? Yeah. And it goes round and come back here? Yes. Yes? yes. Okay. So see how the, the time uh, will rise, depending who you ask. So he said three to four hours. So for the record, it is now three o'clock. Let's see when I will be done with this trail. And we have some chickens here. Oh, actually quite a lot of chickens. Hello. Namaste. <laughs> There's a beautiful view to the left. There's a beautiful view in front of me. Uh, although it is a bit foggy, but uh, 
yeah, I'm not complaining about things I cannot change. Still going to enjoy this. Ah, yeah, so I would like to go down there. And I think if we follow this path right here, that will hopefully lead us down there. But that actually looks like quite a walk. And then coming back here later on. But that's all right. Can I walk here? I can walk here. Oh, not sure. I don't want to step into someone's backyard here. Oh. Namaste. I would like to uh, walk down there. <laughs> I can uh, I can walk down there. I'm trying to uh, to walk down there. There's a there's a trail here. But the way is not good. It's not good way. Yes. Can you recommend another way? Is there a better way? You can go from here. Yeah. Go back that side and you have to go there down. There and that one green hotel, the A's. Okay. And that is you can go from the stairs. There ah. is the stairs. You can go from there. Okay, and that is easier to go down there. Yes. Yeah. Sure. Done your butt. Thank you very much. <laughs> You have a beautiful view here. Is that uh, your house or hotel? No, this is my house. This is your house? Yes. Ah, so you have this view every morning. Yes. Oh. Can you see the Mount Everest from here? Yes, if, uh, if it's it clear? Is a cloudy day. Yeah, but normally? It's normally in another day when the day is clear and when it is sunny day, we can yeah. see from Oh, there. it's over there, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, I would like to see that. But uh, no lucky today. Oh, imagine living here in the mountains and you have a Mount Everest view from your from your terrace. That is uh, quite nice, right? Uh, down there. Oh, what what would you recommend? Where is the most beautiful? I will show you the way up to there. You show me the way? Yes. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. How is it to uh, to live up here? Is it is it a nice place to live? Yes, the environment is also clean. Yeah, right. It's clean here, right? Fresh air. Oh. No pollution, no sound pollution also. Yeah, in the past days in Kathmandu, the yes, pollution was very strong. Cool as well, yes. And here is very, very fresh air. Do you grow tea around here? You have tea, like a tea plantation. No, no tea. Because I thought what she is picking is maybe tea. No, she's cutting the grass. Ah, just cutting the grass. grass for ah. That goes okay. Here. I thought maybe you have tea here in the mountains. From here. Yeah. And when you go there, you will have it there. Look at that. What I think electricity, that hydropower, or you know? Ah, yeah, you the power. That? You will go there. Ah, that's where I can walk along. Yes, you can go this side. Yeah. Okay. There is a way to go downside, this side also, and from this side. And then I can walk back up here. Yes, you yeah? come this yeah, side and you will leave there. there. Ah, okay, I will end over there. Yes, and from okay. there, there is way you can ask for somebody ah. there. Some okay. For some people also. Okay, so I just go the stairs down here. Yes, there is. Oh, perfect. From east side is only up to there. Yeah. Then after there is uh, okay. not a road also, but a way. Okay. Small way. Sounds easy. Okay, okay. Okay, done your butt. Thank you very much for your help. Okay, okay nice to meet you. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. All right. Meeting friendly locals here in the mountains. Oh, it is a bit slippery here. And the, the ground is covered with uh, old bottles. So there's probably a lot of uh, glass around here, so you should be careful. Yeah, I don't think that this is the, the proper trail that uh, I saw on Google Maps. But uh, it is a way down there. That's all I need. Yeah. <laughs> it's very slippery here. All these, uh, yeah, whatever this is. I think it's coming from uh, these trees here. Not sure how to call it in English. Uh, it makes it very slippery here. Uh, and as you can see, there's no fancy or something else protecting. Uh, 
Yeah, just making a little uh, stop here to admire the view. Now, even though it is foggy today, you can still have a breathtaking view here. And now imagine this without the fog, without the clouds. Yeah. This is the Nepal that I came to see, basically. This is what Nepal is famous for. Mountains, hiking, views. This is what you want to see when you visit this beautiful country, right? Well, actually, this is my first time standing underneath such an electricity pole. It looks almost like a, like a zip line down here. That would be cool if you could zip line down to the valley there. Huh. Namaste. Hello. Uh. Namaste. Hello. <laughs> oh. oh, I have a rough. Hello, Namaste. Oh, I have a lot of respect carrying around these heavy baskets here. And most of the, the ladies look like 60, 70 years old. Just casually walking around the mountains here with a heavy basket on their head. Well, a lot of respect for that. Hardworking uh, ladies up here in the mountains. Also, yeah, I spent, I think now at least 20 minutes here flying the drone, taking some pictures for my Instagram. If you're also uh, curious to see what I'm up to every day behind the scenes, uh, feel free to follow me on Instagram as well. Usually I post daily stories. This is actually quite interesting. They use these trees here to uh, put up the electricity wires here. And I see that all around here. So that's actually quite interesting. So even up here in the mountains, the few uh, houses that you see here, they probably all have electricity. So living up here in the mountains isn't too bad, I think. And there's another motorcycle driving by. Oh, namaste. Namaste. <laughs> Can I walk here? Yeah. You want to go to town? Yeah, yeah. Do you know if there's a village where I can drink tea or something? Tea? Yeah? Of course. Down there? Uh, you have to go uh, 10 minutes down. 10 minutes down? Yeah. yeah? Okay. Yeah, basically, this uh, part of the road was just created two minutes ago. There was just a, a, a sand mountain. What do you call that in English? In Sandhaufen, as I would say in German. Not sure what's that in English. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let me move out of the way. Okay. Namaste. Hello. Imagine how difficult it must be to uh, get a big heavy vehicle like this up here in the mountains. Oh, God damn it. Oh. Like driving up this road here with this heavy vehicle. Probably takes a while. By the way, just for the record, it is now 4.30. So already one and a half hours into this little hike here. It is a little bit like a maze here. There are some paths all along in between here. And then this main road, if you want to call it like this. And down there is a fire. Somebody makes a fire down there. Maybe burning some garbage. But I'm actually not sure where this village is that the guy on the motorbike was talking about. Because I'm walking already for quite a while after I met him. Not sure. But uh, we say in Germany, der Weg ist das Ziel. Which means something like the, the road is the destination. So it doesn't really matter where you end up, as long as you enjoy the journey to get there, you know? And I totally do that. I mean, who wouldn't enjoy walking around the scenery like this? Yeah, what a beautiful corner of the world this is. Namaste. Namaste. Do you know if there's a tea house or a restaurant? Tea house? Tea house to drink tea? You're not sure? No. Like, or is there a village? Yes. Yes? Okay, thank you. Hello. Hello. Hello, Hello. 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 Hello.
Hello, <laughs> Musti. Maybe they're coming from, from school. I think uh, what they are wearing is a school uniform. I saw a couple of kids uh, also in Kathmandu before wearing similar uniforms, so I think that's the, the local school uniform here. Namaste. Hello. Oh, that looks very heavy. Oh. Do you need a... Uh, you want? Money? Oh, let me see if I have a little bit. Okay. 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 Have a good day. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Holding? Dan tea? Thank you. Here? Yeah? yeah? Okay, okay. Oh. I think she's inviting me for some tea. Let's see. Oh. Do you need help? Do you need help? Oh, I feel bad because it looks actually very heavy. Should I help you? With this? You want to give me? Oh, I think she's not really understanding. Here? Oh, okay, okay. Hello. Oh, so many baby chickens running around here. Ah, your chickens? Ah. <laughs> oh. oh, that looks very cute. So many chickens. Ah, oh. ah yeah, okay, I'm coming. Ah, she uh, raised me over here. Oh, there's a goat here. Some buffalo, I think this is buffaloes. Oh. Oh. I think I'm ending up in a little village here now. That is lovely. Oh. Oh. This is your home? Ah, your home? Ah. Oh. Can I can come inside? Yeah. Waiting? Okay, I will I will wait here. Maybe oh. your your head? Ah, what, what what is this? What was it that you were carrying? Maybe something from the fields? Or maybe some groceries? I'm not sure how they get groceries up here. But uh, oh, oh I can sit. Ah oh thank you what? Thank you very much. Let's just see what will happen. I have no clue. Oh, what is this? Oh. Not sure what it is. You are uh, you collected on the field? Hmm. This from the from the field? You bring it here? What is this? Uh, smoking. Or drinking. Okay, I'm not sure. This, uh, she meant this is for smoking or for drinking, but she had a cup in her. Actually, let me stand up. I feel bad uh, that she's uh, preparing something for me now. But uh, she was uh, very inviting. Oh. Actually, I am uh, taller than, than the house here. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, I have absolutely no idea what will happen now or what she is preparing, but. I'm happy to try. Oh, chickens running around everywhere here. Oh, even there's some some baby chickens underneath here. Oh, even a, a big chicken as well. Oh, oh this is uh, milk. Ah, oh. oh, okay. Okay, drinking. Yeah. Ah, oh. maybe this is uh, milk from 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 her animals here. Okay, let me try it. Mm, yeah, it's definitely not. Oh, very good. Thank you very much. Oh, oh all the baby chickens here. Oh, hello, hello. <laughs> mm, I'm not sure if this is cow milk. It tastes a little bit different. Chicken? Oh, I'm not sure what, what she means. <laughs> mm, I think this is not cow milk. It doesn't really taste like cow milk. So maybe it's uh, milk from the, from the goats here. Not sure, but it was refreshing, delicious. Ah, egg. Ah, no, no, thank you. No, thank you. I, I just ate. I'm full. Ah, that was really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Then you what? Then you what? What is this? I'm not sure what it is. 
Hmm? You, you smoke it? Oh. I'm too tall for your house. I can't stand here. <laughs> yeah, that's better for you, better for me if I, uh, if I wait outside. Because this is actually uh, too small for me. Ah, oh, you want to put it in there? Ah, no, 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 I don't need it. No, no, no. Um, uh, no, it's okay. No, you can keep it. No, no, I don't need it. Uh, I think she wants me to take it home in the, in the back here. Ah, this, you, for me to take home? Ah, no, no, I don't need it. No, 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 thank you. No, I don't want to uh, take it away from her. I actually don't need it. It's okay, it's okay. Thank you. Done your what? Um, I don't really want to take it away from her because I don't really need it. But I also want to be uh, polite. For me? Yeah? Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. It's okay. Okay. Okay, nice to meet you. Okay, thank you very much. I, I walk here? Yeah? Okay. Done your what? Nice to meet you. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, that was an interesting experience here. And yeah, she's an old lady living here up in the mountains where there's basically nothing else around. So I really don't have a problem with giving something to, uh, to people like this. She's not a beggar, a young beggar in the city, you know. I mean, this is literally in the middle of the mountains. And she was very inviting, very hospitable, inviting me to your house. Namaste. 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 Hello. <laughs> is this a buffalo? Uh, buffalo? Your buffalo? Ah, okay, okay. Oh, so many animals here. Oh, very nice. Thank you. Done your watch. Done your watch. <laughs> okay. Oh, hello. Do you know what is this? She, the old lady, she gave me this. Hello. Hello. Do you speak English? Yeah. The, the old lady, she gave me this, but I don't know what's this. What? Like she gave me this. Yeah. Do you know what it is? What is this? She wanted to give me this, but I don't know what it is. <laughs> Ganja. For smoking? So this is uh, legal or illegal? Illegal. 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 Not allowed. Oh. Maybe you want to keep it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> also, this is for smoking. Yeah. Like <laughs> when you get high. Yeah, yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> but uh, it's not legal. Yeah, not legal. Ah, but here in the mountain, no problem. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Okay, then you can keep it. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. I'm from Germany. Germany, yeah. Okay, nice to meet you. Thank you. Enjoy the ganja. <laughs> okay, have fun. Have fun. <laughs> Okay, thank you very much. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> All right. Okay, we found out what it is. Oh, Nepali mountain ganja. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, as I said, I don't smoke. All right, I am back up here where I started the trail earlier. It is now almost six o'clock, so I spent three hours down there in the valley yeah if you enjoy videos like this here up in the mountains leave a like that really helps to support my channel and if you haven't seen my previous video where i arrived here where i also showed my hotel here in the mountains check out the video right here stay healthy stay positive and then see you on the next episode ciao guys